have you encountered these symbols? Those little numbers with arrows around them are called, Resin Identification Code, or RIC. They indicate the type of plastic or resin that an item is made from. If you're observant enough, you will notice that they are present on the bottom of most plastic containers out there. Either a drinking bottle, jug, Tupperware or any products made of plastic. Consumers often assume this code means a package is automatically recyclable, but that's not the case. Packages with the code, may or may not be recyclable. The true purpose of resin identification code is to make it easier for workers in materials recovery, and recycling facilities to sort and separate items according to their resin type. Because plastics must be recycled separately with other like materials, in order to preserve the value of the recycled material, and enable its reuse in other products after being recycled. It also helps recycling collectors determine what items they can accept, and which ones go in the trash. There are seven resin identification codes, represented by the numbers 1 through 7. The symbol consists of one of these numbers surrounded by the, chasing arrows, in a triangular shape, or simply a triangle. The symbol is accompanied by an abbreviation of the plastic resin type. Code number 1. Polyethylene terephthalate. Can be recycled. It is the most common and easily recycled plastic, and most commonly used plastic in the world. It is clear, tough, and has good gas and moisture barrier properties. This resin is commonly used in beverage bottles and many injection molded consumer product containers. Examples are Soda bottle Water bottle Jelly jars Toxicity it is intended for single-use applications. Repeated use increases the risk of leaching and bacterial growth. It is known to leach antimony trioxide and phthalate. While antimony may contribute to cancer development, skin problems, menstrual and pregnancy issues, phthalate or endocrine disruptors. Code number 2. High-density polyethylene. Can be recycled. Is considered to be one of the safest forms of plastic more stable than PET, and reusable. It has good chemical resistance. It is used for packaging many household and industrial chemicals such as detergents and bleach. Pigmented HDPE bottles have better stress crack resistance than unpigmented HDPE. Examples are Milk jugs Laundry detergents Shampoo bottles Toxicity Although it is usually considered safe for usage in limited quantity, studies have shown that it can leach nonalphenol, especially when exposed to sunlight, which is endocrine disruptor. Code number 3. Polyvinyl chloride. Cannot be recycled. It has good chemical resistance, weatherability, low characteristics, and stable electrical properties. Examples are Pipes. PVC flooring Blood bags Toxicity It is the most toxic and harmful form of plastic. It contains bisphenol A, lead, phthalate, mercury, dioxins and cadmium. It can cause endocrine disruption, ADHD, asthma and allergies in children. And is also known to be carcinogenic in nature. Code number 4. Low density polyethylene can sometimes be recycled. Used predominantly in film applications due to its toughness, flexibility and relative transparency. Examples are Plastic bags Garbage bags Wrapper Toxicity Comparatively safer. However it is still unknown to leach endocrine disruptor nonalphenol, particularly under sunlight. Code number 5. Polypropylene. Can sometimes be recycled. Has good chemical resistance, is strong, and has a high melting point, making it good for hot fill liquids. Examples are. Toys. Medicine bottles. Bottle caps. Toxicity. This type is relatively safe and stable, but can leach plastic additives and has been linked with causation of occupational asthma. Code number 6. 
Polystyrene can sometimes be recycled. It is a versatile plastic that can be rigid or foam. Examples are Refrigerator tray CD case Hangers Toxicity can leach styrene, a chemical that is also present in secondhand cigarette smoke, which is known to be carcinogen. Code 7, Other. Usually not recyclable as it is such a broad category. This code indicates that a package is made with a resin other than the six listed above, or is made of more than one resin and used in a multi-layer combination. Examples are Oven baking bag Gallon Nylon Toxicity a particular concern is those plastics packaged in polycarbonate containers using BPA, or bisphenol A. A xenoestrogen and known endocrine disruptor. BPA is linked to obesity, cancer and endocrine problems. It is best to avoid usage of plastics, but if you have to use it, there are certain codes that are safer than the others. Safer. Code 2, 4, and 5. Unsafe. Code 1, 3. 6, and 7, 